Are you having a really bad time with your Wi-Fi lately? Is your Wi-Fi is getting slower and slower day by day? Even though you have a very good router in your house, but the performance you are getting from it is very low what you expect. So today I'm going to show you guys some tricks that you can use to speed up your Wi-Fi internet connection. Let's do it. Open Google Play Store. Write Wi-Fi Analyzer. Select Wi-Fi Analyzer from Farproc and install it. After the installation, open it. Accept all the permissions that it needs. Here we can see all the networks around me and their signal strength. Swipe right. Here we can select our Wi-Fi network and see its signal strength. My Wi-Fi signal strength is minus 60 dB. It's around the green zone, but it's not fast enough. Swipe right again. And here you can see the channel my Wi-Fi router is using right now. Swipe right again and I'm going to select my Wi-Fi access point. Here we can see the channel I am using right now, which is 8 plus 4, doesn't have a single star on it because it's very slow. It's congested and there is a lot of Wi-Fi network using it right now. A channel is like a road where a lot of vehicles gets uh, from point A to point B and it gets congested when a lot of vehicles tries to get from point A to point B at the same time. So what we have to do is to find a better road or better channel for our Wi-Fi network to speed up our internet. Let's check the Wi-Fi speed of this channel, which is 8 plus 4. You guys can see it's automatically changed to 3 plus 7 while we are talking about it. So your router automatically changes to a better channel to speed up your internet. But sometimes it doesn't do a good job. Let's check the Wi-Fi speed right now, okay? Then we are going to change the channel manually. So what we have to do is to download Okla Speed Test app from Google Play Store. and install it. After installation, open it. Press next, continue, allow permission, and do a speed test here. So the speed we got from 3 plus 7 channel is 32.5 megabytes download and 20 megabytes upload. Now we are going to change our Wi-Fi channel to speed up our network. We have to open the control panel of your router. What we have to do is to open up your browser and write 192.168.0.1 which is default for most routers. But if this link doesn't work for you, search Google for the network link of your router. You guys can see I'm using a tender router and after entering my username and password, it took me straight to advanced settings menu. From here, I have to go to wireless settings and change the channel from the channel option. You guys remember the channel our Wi-Fi automatically switched to, which is 3 plus 7 has only half a star and the channel we were using before doesn't have a single star. So what we are going to do is to find another channel that has better stars. More stars means more free space on the channel. So what we are going to do is to find a better channel. 
I think 7 plus 11 is going to be a good one. What I am going to do is to select 7 plus 11 and select OK. Our configuration has been saved. Don't worry, you don't have to own a computer to do these settings to your router. You can do all these settings with your mobile phones too. Now you guys can see the Wi-Fi analyzer is reporting that we are using 7 plus 11 channel for our Wi-Fi network. Now let's test our network speed, shall we? Open Okla speed test again and do a speed test right now. As you guys can see, we got from 32.5 megabytes per second download to 41.2 megabytes download and 20 megabyte upload to 31.4 megabyte upload, which is more than 26% improvement of our Wi-Fi speed. Isn't that awesome? You guys came here to see double speed improvement, right? But 26% is not double. But there is a simple trick that you can use to speed up the internet of your laptop or desktop. Connect the cable directly from your router to your computer or laptop. Now I have connected my computer directly with the router using a RG45 cable. Open up the browser and go to speedtest.net and do a speed test here. As you guys can see, I got 92.77 Mbps download speed and 48.53 upload speed with 1 millisecond ping, which is very good. But if I used my Wi-Fi network instead of Ethernet on my desktop, I would have been limited to 41 Mbps download and 32 Mbps upload. That's very low speed. And here we can see more than 2x performance. So guys, the main point is this. Use Ethernet cable to connect your desktop or laptop to your router directly to get a better internet connection. But if you have no choice at all, then select your Wi-Fi channel manually to speed up your internet. So guys, that was all for today. Don't forget to like if you like this video. Also consider subscribing and ring the bell icon. See you guys in the next one.